I got the feeling, hey, tonight is gonna be a good night. Tonight is gonna be good, good night. everybody how you are doing welcome to my youtube channel hello everybody my name is stella i'm a youtuber based in manchester welcome everybody welcome to my new subscribers welcome to my old subscribers i just want to say thank you so much for always coming here to support to share to leave your comment and to like every of our video every of our diy video <laughs> Let me just on what we want to do today. In fact, then today, today, we're going to enjoy this night, me and my husband. We are enjoying this night. This night is going to be a good night, a good night. <laughs> Thank you so much. If you're still thinking whether to subscribe, what are you waiting for now? Please click on that subscription button and the notification button so you get a video whenever we are online. So, hmm, let me tell you what happened though. My husband came home, well, I say two weeks ago, and my husband brought this weird thing that I've never heard of. My husband said the watermelon, ginger, banana, it increase your, you know, sexual activity. <laughs> that it adds, you know, it adds like... It's more like a natural Viagra. I was like, mmm. So I told my husband, don't worry, I'm going to do research on it. And then we'll try it out and see if it will work. But there's a disclaimer here. Oh, our sexual life is good. But you know, as a married couple, there are times you have to spice up some things. So <laughs> I want to spice up some things. Should I be shy for saying that? No. So basically, now let me get serious. So I went and search to see why would watermelon, ginger, and banana act as a natural Viagra. Then why reading articles, doing my research and, and everything. So I found that I went in search. I went in search to like know, okay, what this man is talking about. Is it really true or not? So one thing about me, I always go in research and I'll do my reading to see why watermelon will actually add as a natural Viagra. I know watermelon contains so many, so many nutrients, so many, so many. Then go for nature. And I know watermelon is naturally good for men. Naturally, it helps them with, um, I think, cancer or something. But I just know watermelon is naturally good for men and for boys. So we eat it like every week in this house. But when my husband came with that, do I know that watermelon is Aphrodi aphrodisiac kind of thing that it increases your sexual activity? That's when I actually went in search of it. So what I found out is watermelon has contained an enzyme that they call cetruline. Okay, cetruline in human change into I mean um, nitrogen amino acid. And then that nitrogen amino acid, they call it nitrogen amino acid al alginine or alginine. And nitrogen amino acid alginine increases the no level in human, okay? The no level, NO level in human. And once that is increased, it sends a blood flow to your husband's willy. <laughs> I know some of you understand the wheelie, isn't it? <laughs> it sends a blood flow to your husband's wheelie and it relaxes and dilates your blood vessel, making that blood to easily flow to your husband's wheelie. And we all know that once that blood is pushing through your husband's wheelie, that your husband's wheelie stays and gives you that job that you want. Okay, and then I was like, why ginger? Why, why is Roswell talking about ginger? I went in search of ginger. And I found out that ginger is also used to treat 
erectile dysfunction as well that ginger is also aphrodisiac kind of thing and that it helps you as well send blood flow to your husband's really and then I found out banana and then I found out that banana increases your husband's testosterone more energy stamina to give you that <laughs> you know now so basically what we are going to do now is you know this channel is DIY <laughs> we're going to try it out and normally I found out that you have to take it like regularly for a month okay if you take it regularly regularly for a month you're going to see that improvement because watermelon does the same thing as not um, the um, Viagra that we buy from the store so why not use watermelon instead of going to go buy Viagra and take it for one month and see what will happen so if you want to treat erectile dysfunction watermelon is a long-term strategy for you to treat it and you know what they did a, um, a, a kind of experiment on rats mm. they did experiment on like about 30 rats and they found out that after feeding 30 rats with watermelon they found out that after a month their sexual activities of those rats increased so we're going to give it a try if you want to try you let me know <laughs> and leave your comments below if you've tried it before did it work did it not work and i will come back to tell you whether it worked or not but our sexual life is already good though but we just want to spice things oh husband and wife spice up oh. okay so now let's get into business so i've got my smoothie cup i've got my smoothie blender okay so what i'm gonna do now is I've got my ginger, I've got my banana, and I've got my watermelon. It's as big as my head, no, if not even bigger. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to cut this watermelon and take the one that I need. So I'm not going to use everything, I'm just going to cut what I need. Ow. So let me cut like this. Oh. Nice watermelon. Nice watermelon. Mm. So I'm keeping this side. I just need a little. I've already washed this watermelon before getting here. I've washed the watermelon wash all the things that i need wash my hand wash my surface area wash the things i'm using my chopping board i've done all that so i'm just going to cut a bit and that's what i need so i'm going to use this one Some people do filter it just to get the juice but I'm not going to filter because I want it to be a proper thick smoothie so I'm not filtering it for my husband I'm just going to leave it and then you know make it be a proper thick smoothie so this is my ginger I'm just going to peel this the skin off So we all know that apart from increasing your sexual activity, treating your erectile dysfunction, that ginger is naturally good on its own. Okay, so I'm just going to add my banana now. I'm not going to add any water to it so I'll see if it's going to blend Okay. 
So basically, that's my end product. I'm going to put it in a cup now. And babe, what do you think about this? Are we testing it tonight? Are we going to? No, we're not going to try it out tonight. You have to take like a dose today, three doses tomorrow, and then tomorrow night, <laughs> babe. <laughs> then we can now try it out and see how it's going to work. But I'm going to serve you this one. And then from there, you take today and three doses tomorrow. And then we'll see. So that's it, beautiful people. It's looking yummy. So let me just open it. Oh my God. Look at that. Just look at that. Ooh. Look at that. So that's it, basically. Give it to your husband three times a day for one month. <laughs> your sex life will never be the same. Okay. So we're just going to go try ours now. <laughs> leave in the comment below what you think. If you've tried it before and if it has worked for you, leave in the comment below. If not, give it a try. Married couples, spice up your sexual life. Give it a try and see what will happen. Thank you so much for staying up to this level to watch this vlog, this DIY. Till I come your way again, please help me to subscribe. If you've not still subscribed at this time, please help me to subscribe. See you in my next video. Bye-bye.